Angola, one of the most beautiful countries on the African continent, is located on the southwest coastal part of the African continent. The country is neighbored by three countries including Namibia to the south, Zambia to the east, the Democratic Republic of the Congo to the northeast, and the South Atlantic Ocean to the west. Angola has a population of 34 million people and its capital is Luanda. There are quite a number of facts about this beautiful nation, but in this video we share the 10 interesting facts about Angola that you probably didn't know. If you're new here, welcome. On the channel we share great African stories, so for future videos, be sure to like, subscribe and also share this video with someone that would love to learn about the African continent. Angola is home to the second largest waterfall on the African continent. The Kalandula waterfall is the second largest waterfall on the African continent after the Victoria Falls of Zambia and Zimbabwe. These falls are 105 meters high and they stretch for 400 meters wide making them a great attraction in the country. You should definitely check out the Kalandula Falls on your visit to Angola. Angola is one unique country when it comes to natural resources. The country is blessed with huge deposits of natural resources such as oil and gas plus other precious minerals such as diamond. These have helped boost the Angolan economy and also helped place Angola among the top 10 wealthiest and richest countries on the African continent. The widely enjoyed and recognized Brazilian dance, the Samba dance, is believed to have originated from Angola. Although enjoyed around the world, in Angola it's called the Samba dance and it's enjoyed across the entire country. Now if you didn't know, both Angola and Brazil are Portuguese speaking countries and it's believed that this exchange in dance culture could have happened during the time of the transatlantic slave trade. Angola generally has a young youthful population. Out of the 34 million people in the country, as of the time of recording this video in 2022, 70% of these are believed to be below the age of 25 years, making Angola one of those very productive countries in terms of labor force. The giant sebo antelope that was thought and reported to be extinct was later discovered in Angola and it's treated as a national icon and treasure. This animal is famous for its massive long horns that grow almost 2 meters long plus the animal's broad stature. Thank you. 
The country's name Angola comes from the word Ngola, which was a title given to the kings of the ancient Ndongo kingdom. This kingdom is believed to have been founded between the late 15th to the early 16th century. Although this collapsed in 1671 after the Portuguese invaded the present-day Angola. In Angola, it is illegal to take photos and videos of government buildings and streets, or I should also add photos of the country's currency, the Angolan Kwanzaa. No one in the country is allowed to take such photos, but there is an exception. If you would like to do this, you are required to get a permit from the officials or else you'll be risking going to jail for some long period of time. Angola remains among the few African countries that took a bit longer to fully gain their independence from their colonial masters. The country's independence came after the revolution that happened in Portugal and this forced Portugal into the Alvor Agreement of 1975 that granted Angola her independence in the same year. Out of the 55 countries on the African continent, Angola comes out as the seventh largest in terms of size. The country covers 480,000 square miles in size, which is almost twice the size of countries like France. This makes Angola one of the largest and biggest countries on the African continent. The capital city of Angola, Luanda, has been severally ranked as the most expensive city on the African continent, hence the nickname the Paris of Africa. In the city Luanda, many of the basics of life like food, medical care, transport and many others are highly priced in the city, which greatly increases the cost of living in the capital Luanda. For our Swahili lesson, it is a verb kusema, which basically translates as to say. So if we are to use this in a sentence, we would say maybe nataka kusema na kupenda, which translates as I want to say I like you. This could be a handy verb if you've maybe been shy for a long time and maybe you get that one-on-one -on -one point with maybe a girl or boy that you've liked for some time. Well, that's our Swahili lesson. And if you'd like to go deep into learning the Swahili language, which is one of the most spoken languages on the African continent, we created an easy to learn speak Swahili course that basically takes you from A to Z for you to be able to learn and speak Swahili like a native speaker. So for you to enroll for the course, check out the link in the description. Well, that's Angola and the 10 interesting facts about this beautiful African country. In the comments, let us know which among us these 10 stood out for you and maybe where you are watching from. Do not forget to also like, subscribe and also share this video with someone that would love to learn about the African continent. We recommend you to watch more here to even learn more about Africa. Mm -hmm.